Hola amigos, today I'm going to show you how to fix the problem on the Samsung Galaxy Core Prime G360 when it stacks on the Samsung logo on the screen. For example, this phone when I turn it on, it turns on. This is Samsung Galaxy Core Prime. After that, it comes to it shows the Samsung logo here, and it's stuck there for a long time. It doesn't go to the home screen. So what I'm gonna do, I will. There are like two methods to fix this issue. The first one is hard reset the phone, and the second one, update the software on it. So I'm gonna try the hard reset first. If it works, that's good. If not, I will show you how to uh, update the software on it. So let's put the battery back. So to hard reset this phone, just we need to push the volume up button. This is down and this is up. So we push this side on the top, uh, the top side and hold it and push the volume uh, i mean the home button and after that push the power button and keep holding the three buttons at the same time turns on it shows the core prime after that it will shows the android logo release the power button and release everything so if you see here it shows like some blue writing on the screen in this blue writing it shows in the first option reboot system now and after that option you have apply update from EDB and uh, which option we're gonna choose from here we're gonna go to wipe data factory reset how to scroll down use the volume down so wipe data factory reset and once you select this one with the volume down you can go up by the way by using the volume up but now we are all on the right option so what we, we're gonna do we're gonna just push the power button one small click and after you push the small click you have like here no 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 and you go to the to the yes option yes delete all user data and you push power button and wait for the phone to reboot so it's it shows here in the bottom data wipe complete you know if you can see it data wipe wipe complete so what I'm gonna do I have the other option on the top is selected it shows the reboot system now. So what I'm going to do, I will just push the power button. And the phone will reboot now. And let's see if it reboots normally. That's good. If not, we have to update it through the... Using the computer. You see that it takes longer than it's supposed to. Let's wait a little bit more.
when you do the factory reset sometimes it takes too long but let's wait and here you go the phone turns on after maybe like two minutes I just paused the video by the way so from here I'm just gonna use change uh, set the language let's say English start speak next I understand more thanks next more next next more more next next skip skip finish and there you go phone is fixed and congratulations I will show you for uh, the next another video how to solve this issue using the computer thanks for watching please uh, subscribe and like my videos have a wonderful one